Welcome to the Pharma Voice 100 one on one video series with Taryn Grohn. Suzanne, thank you for joining us for the Pharma Voice 100 celebration and coming to us from Italy. Thank you so much, Taryn. It's a really a pleasure to be with you today. Suzanne, you oversee more than 10,000 associates in 85 countries working to transform cancer care. What are some of the keys to managing such a large global team? For me, Taryn, there are three critical factors, and that is purpose, that is having diverse and inclusive teams, and that is having really a culture that is inspiring. Let me start with purpose. For me, I think it's critical that such a big organization is around one idea. And for us, this is to reimagine cancer and blood disorders and really find ultimately cure for patients with, with cancers. And that's what the organization have in mind every day and is really trying to put uh, in front for every decision we make. The second thing is really to allow diverse and inclusive teams. And, and this diversity for me, that is not only different gender, different background, different education, but it's also different thinking styles. It's different approaches. And I think it's proven, but you also see this, if you allow every voice to be heard, if you allow every idea to be considered, that is when teams really come up with wonderful solutions to tackle a problem. And the third is culture. For me, that is even the, the foundation of all. And I think associates have to feel inspired. They have to feel that they can go the extra mile and that they are supported by their leaders. We at Novartis are on a transformation to really transform our culture to be how we call it, unbossed, curious and inspired. And I think it's critical, especially in these days. That's amazing. Thank you so much for sharing that um, perspective with us. Um, Novartis Oncology is one of the first companies to form a global business unit dedicated to developing and launching innovative technologies, um, innovative technology medicines, excuse me, um, that address the unmet needs of people with cancer and related diseases. What advantages does having this model provide in terms of moving medicines forward? You know, when you look at cancer, unfortunately, it's the fastest growing disease. And, and just to give you some numbers, new cancer cases are expected to rise to more than 23.5 million cases in 2030. So it's devastating and it's really an area where there's significant unmet medical need. And I'm quite happy that we have a dedicated team and our team is thinking about finding solutions for cancer every day and almost every night. So it's really a team that is 100% dedicated. And what that allows you is, of of course that people have knowledge, they have experience, uh, they are uh, rallying around a common purpose, in our case to find cure for cancers. Uh, and I think that also allows you to go bold ways and uh, to really have the courage to engage in novel ways. For example, Novartis, I think, is the only company that is pursuing in all four novel approaches to tackle cancer. We are in targeted therapies, in immuno-oncology. We are also in very novel areas like cell therapies and radiolagic therapies. And I believe it's important because we know cancer cannot be tackled only with one approach. Unfortunately, Cancer is the most intelligent disease that is around. That's how we see it. And to overcome that, we really need to tackle these cells with different modes of actions. And that's what we can do. But having a dedicated unit also means that you can work end to end. You know, from chemistry, when a first asset is developed, that we work closely together as research, as development, and the commercial functions. And that is not always given. And in our case, that's what we want to do. We want to bring teams together from the very early stage and think through all the problems and all the issues that has to be tackled to really find the best for patients. Dan, I can't tell you how much I appreciate this conversation and what a delight it's been to speak with you. Thank you so much for joining us for the Farm Voice 100 celebration.
Taryn, thank you so much again for having me. It was a true pleasure. For more PharmaVoice 100 content, visit www.pharmavoice100.com.